Hi cake friend and welcome to the Home Bakers Hive YouTube channel, a place where bakers get together to learn how to run a profitable baking business. Like, comment and subscribe and let's grow together. Hello cake friends. So today I want to talk to you about something really, really critical. I hear so many cake makers um, in my Facebook group telling me that, um, I mean, I have questions, right? When you enter, like when you ask to join my Facebook group, I have questions and they always tell me stuff like, if I ask them, what challenges do you have in your cake business? One of the ones that commonly pop up is this one. I don't have money to invest in my cake business. All right. Okay, cool. Fair enough. But do you have money to go do your nails? Do you have money for your hair? Do you have money um, for your groceries? If you do, then you do have money, okay? So if you are telling me that you don't have money for your cake business, what you are telling me is that you are not buying groceries. You are not doing your nails, maybe. Okay, that maybe, but okay i mean really stop standing in your own way stop complicating things if you have money for groceries then you can start a cake business right starting a cake business does not have to be complicated if you can buy the ingredients then you can start your first promotion the reason why we are saying we don't have money to start or grow our baking businesses is because we want that big amount by the the KitchenAid mixer, or we want to buy the most fanciest tool. But, you know, there's something like a hand mixer that you can just start out with, and it's not that expensive. But while you're waiting to get that hand mixer, the wooden spoon in the bowl can work, right? And you don't need all those fancy tools. Start making some money from your cake business and then reinvest, okay? Start making some money and start buying those piping tips. But surely you can start somewhere. I have a video on putting out small offers right about here. I want you to watch that one. It's talk about, I mean, it's talking about how to put out small cake offers so that you can make the sale, right? And I'm all about the business side of baking. I don't believe that you should be standing in your own way or I don't believe that you should have any obstacles in starting your cake business. You can start your cake business today by putting out small offers. Check out this video. Okay, so stop standing in your own way. If you can buy um, a, um, groceries for your house, then you can buy that first batch of ingredients to probably you know, put out small offers, repackage and sell them. That video will teach you everything about that. Or you could, you know, buy your ingredients one by one. If you can do your nails or if you can, um, you know, do anything else in life, then you can do it one by one. Don't think, don't overthink it. Don't think like you need to go on this magical day to the cake supply shop and buy all the ingredients and the cakes and, I mean, and the cake uh, ingredients and buy in bulk and get all the fancy tools and equipment that you need. I mean, some of the stuff, that we buy as cake makers it's like it's just like hoarding i mean some cake tools i've bought over the years is literally just sitting in my cupboard some cookie cutters i've bought are literally just sitting in the cupboard so i didn't i don't need all those fancy tools when i'm starting out and we like to convince ourselves to think that we need them we don't because we end up using them only once. Some of them even remain in their packaging and they stay there in the cupboard and we've never used them. What we really need is a good oven, some cake pans. And I have a, um, what I call the cake resource guide, link in the description below that you can just check out to see what are some of the things that is a must that you need to have. That please do check that out. Um, just some basic cake supplies that you need to make a profit. The point of the matter is you don't need all those fancy things. What you need is to start baking and selling. And what you need is to start making a profit. What you need is to price your cake correctly so you can get paid. So don't overthink it. Don't stand in your own way. I will see you in the next video.